Hello friends, in the previous video, we have learned how to read an Excel file using Pandas and display either if you, if you want to display only 5 rows or all the rows that we have seen in the previous video. So what's next? Next is, I will try using the machine learning methods or statistics methods to understand the data, right? So it might be simple correlation, right? Let's try understanding one example where I try to find the correlation between two columns in a data or between several columns within the given data. In order to do that, I have downloaded one data file where uh, there are four columns. Essentially, now I'm trying to find the correlation among the four columns in that data file CSV file, there are four columns. I'm essentially trying to find out what is the correlation that exists between column 1, column 2, column 3 and column 4. Let's try doing that. In order to do that, I have to first import pandas then I have to read that file now. So, why df? You might be wondering. df is the data frame. Right, so pd dot read underscore csv. So whenever you add some file directly here in the collab, so after your runtime, this file you have to reload it. Otherwise, it will not be able to. You will not be able to work with it. Right. So now I have to read this data file. So how do I select the path? Select on these three dots. Say copy path, go and paste it here. Don't forget with the single inverted commas. Right, once this data frame is ready, so that means whatever is there in the Excel file, I have read and it is available in the form of a data frame. Now what I will do is, I will write df.co or R, this is a correlation and I will try to find the correlation that exists between different columns. So you got the result, let us try understanding what is this result saying about. The result is saying that, okay, so duration versus duration, pulse versus pulse, max pulse versus max pulse and calories versus calories. So you can see like correlation is 1, okay. And duration and pulse, how are they correlated? It is negative symbol minus 0.155. And um, duration and max pulse, it is positively related. Similarly, so wherever you have positive sign, that means they are positively correlated. Wherever you have negative, that means they are negatively correlated. So that's about the finding a correlation when you read the data from the Excel file. Right. So, what else can I do with this? Right. So, I can also plot. I can make a plot of this. I can try out with the different plots. Uh, different plots we have studied in the math plot lib. We can use those same functions here as well. Let me show one for you. I will copy these two statements as it is. Then I will copy the matplotlib car statement. Okay, I am not, I have not used previously. Let me type it. Import matplotlib dot py plot. as pld you get a prompt already here right i have read the file now then once i read the file then i can use df dot plot let's see what is what are you going to get you are getting a curve like this right so it's a plot of duration versus all these 
So if I want to change the plot, say I want I do not want a plot continuous plot like this. Instead, I want a scatter plot of only one variable. Then I can do this. I'll copy the same thing. So within the brackets of plot, I will specify what kind of plot do I require. So I'll write kind. What is a kind that I will say? I'll say scatter. Then x is equal to I'll say duration. Then y is equal to max pulse. Then I will display it. Yes. This is a plot. So you might be wondering, where did I get this file from? Data file. That file is available from the W3 Schools website. Okay, I will uh, try give you, giving you that file as well, so that it will be helpful for you to execute these programs. Right. Till now, we have studied like pandas. So pandas, which is helpful for my data processing and so we are writing the data, which is in the CSV file. Right, I can process, I can display it, I can find a correlation. All these operations you have studied in this video. See you in the next video. Thank you.